The best way to make changes to your existing auto ship subscription is to log into your account. And some people don't realize that when you have an auto ship, it does not automatically mean you have an account set up. You may have to click this button to create an account. Once you have created your account, then to make any changes, additions, modifications to your auto ship subscription, you'll want to log in. And once you log in, you'll get to see your entire order history and um, all of your subscriptions, all of your active and inactive subscriptions. So this is the order that I've placed. I just created it today, so it is not, un it is not fulfilled yet. I want to click on Manage Subscriptions, and that's where I'll do just about everything. So these are my current subscriptions. I have a subscription for Catalase set up to ship to me once a month, um, actually beginning today, and then my next charge date will be Saturday, September 16th. And a uh, subscription for DHA to ship once every three months, next time being Thursday, November 16th if I want these to ship on the same date as so many of our customers would, what I want to do is go into this one and change the shipment date to match the other one on November 16th. And then I hit save. And anytime I change any one of these elements, I have to hit save in between. So I can't change this and this and this all in one, all at one time. Now, if I want to increase the quantity of catalase, so let's say I want to receive three of them in November, I just do so like this. Because a bottle of catalase contains enough for one month, whereas a bottle of DHA contains enough for three months. So now if I take a look at my subscriptions, I will see that they will ship on the same day, so they'll be in the same box to me. And um, I can confirm that my shipping address is correct here. I can confirm that my billing information is correct over here. And I can look at my purchase history here. And if I wish to add an additional product to my subscription, then I want to go back to subscriptions and click on add product. If I add a product to my auto ship subscriptions just by going into the cart and by shopping in our store, as I normally would for a one time order, it may not get added to my subscription, my current subscription, so they may not ship together. The products may not ship together. It's better to click on add product here. Choose the product I wish to add. Say for instance, be complex. And then here I can decide how frequently I want to have this shipped. And the default date that will pop up will be the same date I'm due to receive my next subscription, my next auto ship shipment. So it's by default going to say November 16th. I can of course change that date to today or tomorrow or any day I want, but it by default will tell you what your next shipment date is. And if you have more than one subscription, that's different than more than one product. If you have more than one subscription, they will all show up here. You just want to kind of take a look at all of them and make sure that your products are shipping on the same date. So hopefully that helps. If you have additional questions, you can always call our fabulous customer service team at 1-800-979-1405. And anyone you speak with would be happy to make changes to your auto ship for you. Um, thank you for being our customer.